Hi it's Vic, welcome back to my channel and today I'm sharing a really sweet happy birthday card. I'm using some Time for Tea Design stamps for my card today so I'm just stamping out all the images I want to use. So I've got the Be Awesome stamp set, Be Happy and the Butterfly stamp set. And now I'm just going ahead and colouring in all the images. So I've listed all the Copic markers on the screen if you want to use the same colours. And I've also stamped some extra little flowers which are from the B. Alson stamp set. And then once all the Copic colouring's done, I'll go ahead and use the fussy cutting dies and run these through my die cutting machine. And all the Time for Tea design stamps always come with a ton of little accessories. So there are lots of other accessories if you didn't fancy using the flowers. And then for the colouring of the flowers, I've just gone ahead and used the pinks, the greens and the yellows from the Copic markers that I used for the other images. So now all the images are coloured, I'm just going to run these through the die cutting machine with the coordinating dies. And here I have some Cerise plain card, which I've just trimmed down. This is going to be my card base. And I've got some Paper Mill Direct Super Smooth White card for my card front. This is the Scattered Hearts cover plate die, so I'm going to be embossing this today. So I've just got an embossing mat that I've popped in my die cutting machine and I'm placing my cards and then the die over the top. So I'm just running this through my Sizzix machine now and here you will see how lovely it embosses the piece of card. And now once that piece is done, I've just added a die cut piece of grass using some Paper Mill Direct card and I'm just applying some foam tape onto this and then placing it onto my card base which I then also trim down and now I'm just planning where to put all the images and all the little flowers. And once I decided roughly where everything goes, I went ahead and I did all the little flowers that I coloured in earlier. I did them down with some PVA glue and then I also wanted to add another piece of grass. So I've die cut another piece of grass and I'm just sticking this down again using some PVA glue. So now I'm moving on and working on the sentiment. So I've got Time for Tea Designs Your Star stamp set and I've got some Aqua Blue card from Paper Mill Direct and I've got some Versamark ink so I'm just stamping this down and then I'm going to be applying some Wow embossing powder. And this is in opaque bright white, which I love using white embossing powder on my card. So I'm just sprinkling this on top and then I'll go ahead and use my heat gun to heat set this. And once that's heat set, I'll go ahead and just trim the sentiment down using my paper trimmer. And now I'm just adhering the rest of the images. So I've used some foam tape to apply this to the backs of the images and the same with the happy birthday sentiment. The only thing I used PVA glue for was the grass and the flowers. Once everything's adhered down, I've gone in with some Nouveau Jewel Drops in Sea Breeze and I love adding these to my cards and once they're dry, they just look lovely. So I'm just going ahead and adding a couple of drops to my card just to finish the card off. And I also love how the Scattered Hearts panel die embossed. I think it's just a really fun way to do something a little bit different with your cover plate dies. So there we go, the card's all finished. Thank you so much for watching. I'll list everything down below in the description box. Bye.